sit here today to discuss the uh, future of the Indian media. I'm happy to say that uh, I, I think that there are very, very exciting times ahead. Uh, 2012 for the Indian film industry was, I think, a watershed year, a year in which all sorts of cinema worked at the box office. So from a um, uh, rowdy Rathod and an Ekta Tiger to a Pan Singh Tomar and a Burfi, audiences were willing to accept all kinds of cinema as long as it was entertaining and engaging. And what was really interesting was that this viewer was not a different viewer. So someone watching Rowdy Rathod was going a few months later to watch Burfi and having as, as good a time at the box office. And that, what that effectively means for us is that we now need to capitalize on the fact that audiences are telling us that their tastes have broadened and they're willing to accept all kinds of content. We now need to step up to, to, to the plate and give them that. Um, what's also very interesting, of course, is the fact that the, with the uh, rising penetration of the exhibition space, uh, you've got a lot more opportunity to go much deeper in India, which is a very underscreened market. We can reach out to many more viewers and not have them to have to resort to illegitimate means of viewing our films. Uh, 2013, I think, promises once again, and I mean, especially from the last two months that we've seen, to be to sort of to be, be, be taking the same trend forward. I, I think 2013, once again, will tell us that big blockbuster movies can coexist along with smaller probably edgier but high concept uh, films and I think that's really good times for the industry.